So in this example, we will going to be placing a free-floating text. So let's first of all create a text object instead of a label object. I'm changing my last example. Text equals to new text. We're going to leave it as a welcome. Let's organize the imports. It belongs to JavaFX.ScenePack. The reason I did not do it through the constructor so that I can show you the other methods. Now in the basic Java, when we create a class with properties, how do you change a value of a property? You use a setter to do that, right? And to retrieve a value, use a getter. So we are changing a property, so we are using a setter. Exactly the same way. Primary stage dot set scene. Primary stage dot set title. So those were the setters. So we're going to use some setters here. Text, oh, sorry, uh, welcome dot set x means I want it to be on the x coordinate of 50. And I want it to be on the y coordinate of 150. So those are my x and y points. So I want it to be these many pixels down, I mean 150 pixels down, and uh, 50 pixels to the right. And always remember on any window, your top left corner is your 0, 0 point. That's your origin. Everything deviates from there. So that's now I'm going to set my message. Welcome dot set text. Welcome to advanced Java. So remember my group is my root. Okay, to the root, I'm still adding my welcome, which is my text. It was labeled in the last example. Since I kept the same name, I don't have to make changes there. The size of the scene, I'm leaving as it is. I instead of saying a label app, I'm going to say it a text app. We still need to have a scene set. We still need to show. Now, just simply run it. Now, when you run it, you will notice that you now have a text which is 50 pixels away from left and 150 pixels away from top. That's a starting point at the top of that W. Now let's learn to increase the font size of this text. So let's go back to the setters. Welcome dot set font. Again, we are using a font class but not from the AWT package. This is a new font class from JavaFX package. And we are using a font size. Does anyone remember the unit of measurement that we use in desktop publishing for font sizes? The unit. It's not inches, it's not centimeters, it's not millimeters, it is point. Okay, where 72 points equals an inch. So if I say 18 points, that will be one-fourth of an inch. 36 points will be half an inch. 12 points will be one-sixth of an inch. So points is a unit of measurement we use here. So if I say I want it to be 36, it means 36 points. Now I can organize my import. Do not pick AWT font. Pick the font from the text package. Save the changes and now rerun the program. And you will now see a larger text. Welcome to advanced job. So you can only change the size. You do not need all parameters to make it happen.